Hey y'all, and welcome back to Amber's Aspect. I'm Amber Nicole, and this week we're gonna be doing a seven day challenge. I asked you all to send me challenges on social media, and I have them all in this little basket right here. So I'm going to randomly pick one out. Oh wait, this one's not folded, right? Okay, let's fold these really well. Just so you know, I'm not cheating. Like, I, so I didn't put all the same one here. This one says, drink a gallon of water a day. Other one says read 20 pages of a book at night. So just so you know, I'm not cheating and I didn't put the same thing <laughs> on all the papers. I'm really nervous, but I'm really excited. So let's just do this thing, okay? All right. Oh man. Okay. Okay. Okay, grab my challenge. Morning workout challenge at 6 a.m. Oh my gosh, okay. That means I have to wake up every morning at 6 a.m. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Here's my challenge, people. Can you read it? Oh no. Okay. Well, I guess I'm gonna look real good in seven days, guys. <laughs> it's okay, we got this, we can do this. Okay, well, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, guys. It is 6.33, and starting this workout routine, got a late start. I woke up at 6. I just did not get out of bed at 6. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm pretty, like, really regretting this, <laughs> but, we're gonna get it, we're gonna do it, and I'm trying to be quiet because the baby's still sleeping. So, yeah. I guess I will see you guys after my workout, okay? But I have not had coffee yet. Please enjoy this little clip of me working out. Taking a lot of months off of working out is not good, people. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. I am pooped. Like, I, I don't regret that I worked out. Like, obviously, people don't regret their workout. But some coffee would do me real good right now, I think. <laughs> so I'm going to go get a shower and then I'm gonna get some coffee in me so hopefully I'll wake up more but I still feel like really tired and like drained and oh, that workout was rough good morning guys um, it, I'm running a little bit late this morning I really struggled waking up I snoozed my 6 a.m. alarm twice and I laid in bed for like 10 minutes too, more like 15. But I'll show you what time it is. It is 6.45 and I'm just like pooped to like, oh my god, I'm so tired. Um. Yeah, my body is so sore. Oh my god, like my arms and my legs hurt. So that was just another reason why I was like, no, I don't want to wake up at 6 a.m. So I have a late start today. I thought this was going to get easier as the days progress, but I guess we'll just have to keep doing it and see. But yeah, 
I'm exhausted. So let's get this workout in. And also, it's Thursday and I clean on Thursdays. Like, I clean my whole house on Thursdays. So these are my days that I like to sleep in just a little bit because I'm like, um, I'm going to be working hard today. So I'm just going to sleep in a little bit more. But yeah, no, today's struggling. So let's get this workout on and hopefully it works. I'm gonna barf. <sighs> I did it. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Look who I get to see when I wake up early. This cute little face. Oh my god, just so gosh darn cute. Good morning. It's. <laughs> I snoozed again. I'm sorry. <gasps> I hate mornings so much, guys. I don't think you guys understand. I am not a morning person. I was awake. I was just like tossing and turning. Oh god. I just hate mornings so much. Like, we really don't understand. So today I'm gonna do like an ab slash arm workout because my lower body is like about to fall off. I wanna say that waking up is getting easier. It's not. <laughs> Um, I will say that the waking up part is just the hardest part, but like right now, like yesterday I felt like death. Right now I feel a little bit more like, okay, let's do this, like let's get it done. So we'll see. To be honest, I really don't think I'm going to keep up with waking up at 6 a.m. after this challenge because waking up at 6 a.m. sucks if you don't have to, so we'll see. I don't know. Who knows? Maybe by day seven, I'm gonna be like, oh my god, I love this. Let's do it every day. I doubt it, but... <laughs> like a 30 minute video for abs and arms and then um I felt really tight and like my legs and stuff so I decided to look up a yoga video and I feel really good like um it wasn't like an intense cardio workout today like I broke like a little sweat not it wasn't extreme but I feel after my yoga and breathing I just feel not like poop all the videos that i watch on youtube they have modifiers so two days ago i would just about every exercise that we did i modified it because your girl was struggling i pushed myself to do like the not the modified version and uh, i was getting it um i think there was maybe one that i modified but other than that i did all of them and i'm really proud of myself and um, did a little bit of yoga and got my breathing on I got my Zen on so I think it's gonna be a good day I think I'm gonna be doing yoga after my workouts more often because I just feel like stretched and not tight and I feel really good so all the workouts I'm doing they're all from YouTube um, I'm not paying for anything I'm subscribed to a couple of channels I'll link the channels down below just about any workout I want to do 
I find it on YouTube because I can't go to the gym because I have Addy and I have nobody to watch her during the day. So at nighttime is my time for Eric, so I don't want to go to the gym in the evening. So this YouTube actually just like works out so well. So yeah, I'm gonna go get some coffee because your girl needs some. And yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Good morning. So it is day four of my seven day challenge and it's Saturday. So I thought today was gonna be like the hardest day because my husband's home and he's asleep. I thought for sure like I was gonna just press snooze and be like, you know what? Nah. I didn't think I was gonna be motivated today, but I only snooze my alarm once. Look at me. And it is 626 right now. Morning. So you know I'm not lying. I didn't struggle as much to get out of bed today. I really thought I was going to. I really thought I was going to just like cancel my workout today. But no. I'm motivated. What's motivating me is that I'm going to wake up, do my workout, take a shower, probably go take a nap. Let's go get some water and let's go get our workout in. workout is all done. I stopped maybe like 15 minutes ago so my little workout glow is kind of gone and my watch died so there's that. Who else hates when their watch dies when they're working out? But anyways, um, yeah I feel good this morning. I didn't, um, I definitely don't feel the way I felt two days ago but um, yeah I feel really good. I feel energized. I feel like I'm about to go and wake my husband up so he can be on this level with me but um yeah so we're just gonna get our day started um i said i was gonna take a nap but probably not pretty bouncing off the walls already so i'm gonna take a shower and go wake my husband up so yeah i'll see you guys tomorrow bye good morning um it's 6 22 look at me i did not snooze the first alarm. I am very proud of myself and I thought for sure I was going to, but I am really motivated today. You know why? Because it is Sunday, which means the Cowboys play today. So I'm gonna get this quick workout in and then I'm gonna take a shower and then watch the football game. So it's gonna be awesome. I feel good this morning. I don't feel um, as like extremely exhausted. When my alarm went off this morning, I wasn't like, oh my god, FML. No, so I feel pretty good. So, let's get started. toning workout um, it's Sunday and we live in an upstairs apartment so I don't want to be jumping all over the place like waking everybody up so I did a pretty in place workout but yeah my butt hurts and my abs are burning so <laughs> yeah um, I wanted to do a little bit of yoga but I gotta go wake the husband up because his football game starts like now and yeah so I gotta wake him up so we can watch that so I'm gonna go take a shower and then we're gonna watch our football and drink some coffee and it's gonna be a great Sunday. So that concludes day five of my seven day challenge. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Good morning. It is day six of my seven day challenge. And let me tell you, thank God tomorrow is the last day. <laughs> oh my God, I am 
so tired. Today was rough. Today, this morning was rough. It's Monday and I stayed up late last night. I stayed up till about one in the morning because I had to fold laundry and clean. So this morning I really struggled getting out of bed. And yes, I snoozed my alarm about three times. Um, it is now 6.42 in the morning. So yeah, that was my bad, guys. I <laughs> woke up late. I did. So, I'm sorry. This is why I don't wake up early. This is why I'm a stay-at-home mom. Because I hate mornings. <laughs> I hate them. Oh my god, like... I'm sorry. I'm, I'm lying. I don't hate mornings. I hate waking up early. Yesterday... When I woke up in the morning, I was like, you know what? I think I can do this, like, on the rigs, you know? Like, I think I can totally, like, wake up early and get that workout in before the baby wakes up and start my day off, right? Today, when my alarm went off, I was like, yeah, no, maybe not. I mean, I'm pretty sure going to bed at 1 in the morning last night didn't help at all. So, I guess we'll just see. But let's get this workout in. Okay, workout's done. Um, feeling really good. I can feel my body getting better and pushing itself more. I'm able to do a lot more of the exercises as opposed to a few days ago when I just started. Like, my body was really tight. Um, I wasn't able to do a lot of it, and I had to modify just about every exercise. But today, I did it all. I pushed myself more. Um, I even found myself doing, like, when the instructor would say, like, okay, this is your last one, like, I would push and do some do like two more so I'm feeling really good can I just say it is amazing like what an exercise will do because <laughs> not too long ago I was literally like dying of being super tired but right now like I think I'm gonna do some yoga because like I want to do a little bit more so yeah um, I'm feeling really good right now the other day when I did yoga, I felt super good after. I felt really stretched and ready to start my day. So I'm going to do that again. Good morning. I woke up late. I did. It is now 6.45 in the morning. I had a lot of trouble sleeping last night for some reason. I was like tossing and turning. I just like could not sleep in the middle of the night for some reason. It is our last day of the 7 day challenge and I'm so happy. <laughs> Guys, I have hated waking up early. I mean, I like how I feel afterwards. I like how I'm like, yeah, like I got it. Let's tackle the day. But yeah, no. I'm just so tired. And waking up is really the hardest part. Just waking, me waking up is the hardest part. My alarm going off at 6 a.m. Is a bit dramatic. Maybe I'll start waking up at like 8 a.m. to work out. I don't know. Who knows? I'll keep you guys posted on that. First things first. Let's get hydrated. I hate when my husband doesn't refill it. I don't know what I'm going to do today. Um, I don't like to do the same exercise all the time because then I get really bored of it and then it makes me not motivated to work out at all and I already struggle with motivation to work out so I like to switch things up a lot and the good thing is is that you can literally find any workout you want on YouTube I also have the cycling bike here so that works too so if I just do not feel like doing all that stuff like I could just get on the bike and bike for like an hour or whatever so yeah I have a good variety of stuff to choose from so I love that because if I didn't I'd probably get super bored and not want to do it super excited to finish this day um, let's finish it off strong so let's go get this workout in
it. I am done with my seven day challenge. Oh my God, I'm so happy. <laughs> I did it. My rings are closed, if you can see. Love that feeling, but uh, yeah. <laughs> I am so happy I'm done with the seven day challenge. Waking up sucks. The working out part, I didn't manage, but the waking up was the hardest part. And yeah, I would snooze, but I don't think you guys understand just how difficult it is for me to wake up in the morning, like, and early, like, in the morning. Like, it's just, it's not a fun time. But I did it, and I'm proud of myself, and um, I'm glad I did because I got back in the groove of working out. I'm not going to be waking up at 6 in the morning anymore, but I am definitely going to stick to working out because I feel good and I want to get my body stronger and um, the workout I just did kicked my butt and <laughs> I did a few modifications but because this chick really worked us out like yeah to be totally honest had I not been recording this and had I not told social media that I was do doing this like I probably would have given up by the second day and been like mm, nobody knows I'm doing this so it's cool we're just not gonna wake up early but the fact that I told everybody and the fact that I was vlogging it, like, that was motivation enough for me to be like, okay, I'm not a punk, like, let's do this. So, yeah, in all honesty, the only reason I stuck with it was because I told y'all about it. So, thanks for motivating me and thanks for pushing me because, yeah, no, I totally would have given up by, like, the second or third day because it was brutal so it's the end of our seven days thanks so much for going on this seven day challenge with me i wanted to do a proper outro outro there's an intro and an outro out whatever i wanted to do a proper ending so you could see me like not look like a zombie in the morning but this was big for me because I get pretty self-conscious when I don't have like makeup on and stuff. More so like I'm self-conscious working out in front of people. So the fact that I took videos of most of the workouts and yes, they're super fast forwarded. However, I still did them. And so this really took me out of my comfort zone. So now it's kind of like, I don't care how you guys see me. Like what you see is what you get. But thanks so much for watching my challenge. But if you haven't already, go ahead and like this video and subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell if you want to get notified every time I upload a video. But thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys next week. Bye!